Hi there and welcome back to another Lazy Sunday. Now, I cannot believe that I've never done a full flip through of The Country Diary. I've done one of the nature notes, uh, but never of The Country Diary. And I was lucky enough for my birthday, uh, one of my lovely subscribers, Carol, sent me some money and I ordered, it is second hand, but um, I ordered myself this copy with the purple cover which I really did want and this is going to be my uh, copy um, which I shall keep and obviously not rip up. Um, I love how it's got the little um, ribbon bookmark. So let's let's have a look, look at these end pages. I have fabulous these. I had a paper pack once what was free with a, some card magazine and it did have that uh, print in. And it's funny because I did think like, well, I've never seen that print before, but obviously it's it's from this book. So the, the pages are so nice and clean. Um, this was published actually in the United States in 2018. So even though the pages are on a nice cream colour, they've obviously not got the patina um, but it's on a beautiful uh, coloured paper. Very, very nice. One of the first um, file folders I did. <laughs> I did it with that cover. I do love that page. These are fabulous for fussy cutting out. Because uh, I never use the Paul Moore hen. Don't feel like anybody's ever like gone in it. The pages are still quite creaky, like that newness creaky. I wouldn't be surprised if this hadn't been some, some copies somewhere, just, just sitting somewhere, because the damage does look like shelf, just shelf damage. No, shelf, shelf wear and tear, should I say. And so it's not, not damaged. The paper feels thicker than, than the original. I don't know if it is or if it isn't, but it definitely feels uh, thicker. It's a lovely matte as well. I'm glad they didn't, you know, decide to do it in a shiny uh, version. I think because I've used this book so much and <clears throat> we've flipped through it, you know, as I've been taking pages out and things, I think that's why I've probably not done a full flip through. And it's not very often that I've got a full copy because I buy a couple of copies and, and I use them. So I think every time I've thought about doing it, <laughs> I've not had a full, full copy. Now I do have the um, Life Story um, book and I'm not sure if I've done a flip through it of that. Um, Sue sent me that. I don't know if she sent it me last Christmas or it might have even been last birthday to be honest. So I will check if I've done that and if I haven't, I shall. Um, I do want to order myself nature notes uh, copy I, I don't think they did any kind of limited edition covers on that one i think they've just got a soft cover and a and a hard cover um so yeah i think when i order one if i get a really decent copy i'm gonna keep that for myself I 
pages. It's so, so nice. Yeah, I think it's definitely thicker and it feels really good. So these feel like 200 GSM. It's like maybe not 200, but getting on for it. Yeah, very nice colour what they've chosen to go with. My favourite pages. Just keep thinking because I've seen uh, Karen from Junk Box Journals mix the fairies with the easy fold, and I keep thinking how oh, fairy would look nice there. A fairy could sit on on there. Um, so I think next year I'm definitely going to do a mix the Edith with the flower fairies. I thought that was an absolutely fabulous idea. I've never seen uh, it done before, whether it has been or I'm guessing somebody's done it at some point. But yeah, I thought it was fab. done a file folder with that on the front as well and then we've got the the index pages so that is that so thank you so much carol um i really appreciate it so yeah it is us um which is surprising because uh like carol doesn't own a copy um yeah other people in america they seem to pick them up really cheap so it must be you know whatever uh state you're you you live in so that is the country diary of an edwardian lady so thank you very much for joining me and i shall see you very soon bye for now